All right, guys, so we're at Sport and Gaming Cards here. We're in Niles, Illinois, I believe. I dropped my girlfriend off at the airport. This is in like a little mall, as you can see. Um, I Googled this place and found it, so we're gonna see what the heck we got in here. It's like a pretty cool little shop. Some nice deals here. Salute to Hoops guys, welcome back. I hope you guys enjoyed the beginning of the video. Uh, we'll recap that in a moment. First I wanna, number one, thank everyone for subscribing. We're up to 111 subs. Uh, you guys really keep me going with this um, and the hobby and just kind of making these videos. So I really wanna thank you. Uh, number two, I wanna congratulate my boy collecting on a budget. I'll link his YouTube in the bio and maybe have it pop up on the screen somewhere over here as well as Instagram uh, but I want to congratulate him for his 1,000 subs on YouTube huge congrats to him we started these uh, YouTube channels roughly around the same time I think during the quarantine uh, and his has blown up so a big congrats to him um, go ahead and make sure you guys follow him on the on the gram and subscribe to his channel Always good content over there. Uh, me and him kind of do the same things with the whole budget stuff. So if you like my stuff, you'll definitely like his. So definitely uh, congrats to him. And hopefully uh, 1,000 more. Uh, moving on. Uh, the beginning of this video was the uh, local card shop I found out in Illinois. Uh, Golf Mill Mall, Niles, Illinois. Stopped in there on my way back uh, from the airport. Dropped my girlfriend off. Uh, it was a cool little shop, um, a lot of product in there, um, some cool budget stuff. So it, it was a quick little recap in there. I hope you guys got at least a, a little glimpse of it. Um, if you live in the area, go and visit him. The guy that runs the joint, it's a pretty cool guy, very conversational. So uh, I'm going to go over just some cards that I got in there out of that little 50 cent, uh, sorry, 50% off uh, box that you saw in the video. And then we're going to rip some illusions as well. So um, I think I spent a total of this was six bucks. So there's nothing too crazy in here. I did get this uh, Steve Francis um, tops. Uh, it's not chrome or anything like that. I don't know what series it is. It looks like an insert baseline. Uh, I was a huge Steve Francis fan when I was a little kid. So I got this for $1.50. It's uh, numbered out of 99 so uh, definitely a dope little card you gotta wonder how many of those 99 are actually around still um i mean this is from 2006 so it's, it's when he was on the orlando magic not his best years by any means but still a dope card so i picked that up couldn't pass it up for a dollar 50 especially at a 99 uh, and my boy steve francis fun fact i actually met him once pretty cool guy uh next we have a uh, shaquille o'neal I believe I had this in a different video as well when I picked up this card at, at an LCS in uh, Long Island when I was visiting my girlfriend over there. Nice little Shaquille O'Neal um, from 2000, 99-2000 series, or sorry, 96, excuse me. 
After further notice, sorry. <laughs> further inspection, yes, it was 1996, guys. I had to make sure of that. So that's why there's going to be a little cut in the video. Oh, well. Um, but yeah, I just like this card for some reason. It's a, it's a super clean card. These older Topps cards are, are, are dope just for the fact that they're like nice and simple, I guess. The simplicity in comparison today with like mosaic and prism stuff. Uh, definitely a cool card with Sean Kemp chilling in the back there. Looks like Shaq's about to grab a rebound and Kemp is not even attempting to go for it. So for a dollar, definitely a cool card. And then I got some... A uh, bunch of just three KGs, uh, Kevin Garnett's. These are all from, uh, this is one of his earlier ones, obviously. Uh, Fleer 95-96. Definitely a dope card. Excellent condition, uh, given the year for sure. And then two of his uh, prime years back in 2001 uh, with the upper deck. So figured for a buck. One of my favorite players from back in the day. Why not? Uh, and we almost forgot this one right here. Uh, this Ovation one is pretty cool too, in my opinion. Um, nothing super special about it, but it's got the um, that like basketball type material on the on the card there. So definitely a cool card as well. Or my boy KG um, from uh, 2000 and one as well i believe so definitely a cool card right there like i said nothing super special here but they were some pretty cool cool little cards especially the steve francis out of the 99 so <sighs> glad i could share that with you guys um oh we forgot to mention daniel gafford's joining us for the break today the rip i bought this off of mercari for eight dollars and just came in today and i am definitely happy with with my results on that purchase because I do think Daniel Gafford is going to be playing a pivotal role in the Bulls uh, new, with the new regime that we have. Um, I did mention him in a, my past video as well as far as an investing standpoint goes. We got Derek Favors, James Harden, Jaron Jackson Jr. numbered to 125. Oh, there we go. Not bad at all. Second year. We will take it. Alex Caruso, Kawhi Leonard, Bam Adebayo, Bruno Fernando, Admiral Schofield, and Nikhil Alexander-Walker. Let me at least get a penny sleeve on that. Because that is a beautiful card for sure. All right. We'll get him in a top loader after this. All right, guys. Not so bad. Not too bad. Darius Garland on the back there. Sorry to spoil the surprise in the back. Goran Dragic, Miles Turner. We got Tobias Harris. We got Derrick Rose. CJ McCollum Acetate. Miles Turner once more. Kemba. Jalen Brown. Isaiah Roby. Ja Morant. There we go. Perfect. Nice little few packs so far. And we can't get it open, of course. I know I feel it feels like I've been talking about this for weeks, but I seriously cannot wait for the draft coming up. Really want to see what the Bulls are doing. There's a bunch of rumors flying around about what they're gonna do. Oh, give me one second, guys. I had something cooking. And we are back, guys. I apologize for that was actually making some chocolate chip cookies because why the hell not Troy Brown Jr. Robert Covington Bajan Bogdanovich insert all right random but all right Danny Green Jeff Teague we got Lou Williams Eric Pashal Brandon Clark and Tyler Hero not a bad group of rookies so far here Put that right here. Promise that is the last cut for the video, guys. Last cut. All right. Andrew Wiggins, Andre Drummond, Drew Holiday, Mike Conley, Zach Levine, Acetate, OG Ananobi, 
Orange Parallel, Ingles, Harry Giles, JJ Reddick, Jalen Noel, Goga, and Rui Hashimura. Can't wait to actually see him play again this year as well. I think the the Wizards are going to have a decision to make when it comes to John Wall, and I think they're going to end up... Uh, well, first, I don't know who's going to take his contract because it's ridiculous, um, but I just feel like John Wall is not the future of the franchise anymore, to be honest with you. Just my opinion. Terrence Ross, Bruce Brown, Giannis... Another Giannis little acetate there. Brandon Clark. We will definitely take that. Rudy Gobert. Joel Ingles. Harry Giles. Another Goga. Another Rui. And Kevin Porter Jr. All right. All right, cool. Let's go over the, the hits here, guys. Nothing too major. We did get that nice Jaron Jackson Jr. Numbered out of 125, which is dupe. 102 out of 125. We'll take that for sure. Uh, nice little Ja Morant. And then the Brandon Clark Orange Parallel. Then some other rookies here. We got Goga, Rui, Kevin Porter Jr. Another Goga. Another Rui. Eric Pichal. Your boy Tyler Hero, so on and so forth. No Zions or anything like that, but we will survive. All right, guys, so that concludes this video. Nice little mix of some stuff here. We had uh, some Hobby Shop pickups, a Hobby Shop visit. We had a rip, so uh, definitely cool. Love doing the Hobby Shop videos, guys. Uh, when I when I travel or my, if when I'm going somewhere, I like... Uh, stopping in just to see what what other card shops have in comparison to the ones around here so hope you guys like the videos as well hope you guys enjoyed this video um, once again congrats to my boy collecting on a budget and I will see you guys next time new video I got three new videos in the works so stay tuned for those I appreciate you guys watching and thank you for the support I will see you next time